Why don't you give me a sign? Like the sea that leaves a trail And on that show, it's not your problem, it's mine Everybody thinks that I'm okay Sometimes I think I am too I'm on the outside looking in I'm waiting for the shockwaves to begin Oh, won't you let me hold you for one time? Just a rainy day In a London cafe A London cafe Hello, I'm Sophia Jessica, and welcome to the Fan Carpet. Stephen, it's amazing to be with you, and starting with the big question, can you talk about for you what the magic of Transformers is, and what it was you wanted to do with this film that was perhaps unique and a bit different? Oh, that's a great point. I feel like the magic for me, the first introduction for me was the 1986 film, right? And in a big way, it showed the relationship between like a Transformers and a human being and working together. Um, in terms of the live action movies, I feel like the magic in this film that we haven't seen in live action would be the exosuit and like a human being actually turning into a Transformer. Going from like not feeling like he's important at all and looked down upon to like becoming this hero at the end of the film was like the magic. And I think one of the biggest challenges for Transformers is always bouncing a human story mm -hmm. with intergalactic robot wars. Um, exactly. Can you talk a little bit about what the human heart of this is and how your amazing cast, particularly Anthony, help you find that? Yeah, no, I mean, it's Anthony and Dominique Fishback. Uh, the first time the franchise had black and brown lead. Um, and so for me, it was important that we felt like, uh, I don't know if they're going to be in a film that their issues and their obstacles felt real and grounded. So they both deal with these sort of societal sort of glass ceilings, if you will, over each one of them, um, where they're looked down upon and or credit is being taken from them at, at their workplace or anything like that. So um, seeing them become like go from here to like here in the film was yet like the goal. Um, and trying to balance that out with Optimus Prime, who also feels pretty low. You know, he doesn't feel like he's providing for his family, so to speak, and getting his people back to Cybertron and saving them. So trying to balance those two things out um, with both casts, Peter Cullen trying to voice Optimus Prime, but still find like that vulnerability within his voice and tone that he can really like sell it. And the humans, you know, going from nobody to heroes was pretty important, especially with the cast we have. And in terms of the amazing new Transformers characters, can mm -hmm. you talk a little bit about some of the most exciting characters that you got to breathe life to and yeah, what it was yeah. from that era of the franchise lore that you were most excited to, to capture yeah. on screen? Beast Wars overall definitely is the most exciting part. Um, Optimus Primal. Uh, a lot of fans were waiting for his presence, his, his intro on the big screen, and to get him right from the design stage to making sure that he can emote, making sure that he felt big and present, but then also like organic and real, like the materials he was made out of. Um, you felt the skin, you felt the fur, uh, and most importantly, you felt the breath, which I felt like was really tough to pull off with a robot because they technically can't breathe, so that's a cheat for everyone out there. Um, but you have his moving parts, and you'll see at times everything just started of working, you know, at every at the same time, giving a sort of a rhythm and like a breathing pace that just made him come to life on camera. And talking about making things bigger, obviously. You have the privilege of finally establishing a official shared Hasbro universe with this film. Uh, yeah. I'm curious if there was ever a discussion about that being a bigger part of this film than it is, and uh, if mm. you feel going forward uh, that that sets up some interesting possibilities. No, it was never meant to be bigger. I mean, there was one moment where I was thinking, like, should after every sort of battle scene or something like that, should we see that there's an organization tagging along being like, who the hell did this and trying to put the clues together 
but it's something about the way the ending scene works right now and like the surprise of it all knowing that someone was watching the entire time we just didn't know feels really good and uh yeah i'm excited about the what we've been calling or you guys have been calling the crossover and like the bridge in between another universe uh or another ip um it's exciting you know it's another one that i love it's one that i i grew up with the toys having and playing with and so for me to hopefully bring them in and, and figure out how to way to combine these guys on a big level is, is exciting. I definitely do. I definitely want to direct that one, especially since I, I brought it and introduced it in this film, for sure. It's yours, you're on it now. Um, <laughs> I appreciate that. <laughs> we can't wait for all of it, and congratulations on this one. Thank you, man. Appreciate Thank you. it. Cheers. Thank you for watching The Fan Carpet. Please follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram for more content next time. I'm here on the largest of the Balearic Islands, Mallorca, with the turquoise waters of the Mediterranean Sea, beautiful mountainous landscape, the thriving city of Palma, quaint little market towns, a growing number of luxury hotels. It's no surprise that the likes of Audrey Hepburn and Elizabeth Taylor like to holiday here. So come and join me as I take you round Mallorca. Thank you for watching the fan carpet. If you like this video, be sure to click that thumbs up button at the bottom of your screen. And also be sure to subscribe to the fan carpet YouTube channels. They're absolutely free. That's so much fun too. Be sure to check out the official website, thefancarpet.com. Also, you can follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram to stay up to date with reviews, competitions, the latest news, and so much more.